Well, you, you see everybody's want to replace you know, light bulbs, incandescent light bulbs, because of their poor energy efficiency, and that is where we come in. Um, everybody's grabbing now these compact fluorescent tubes, and then they have all those complaints about uh, poor color rendering, you know, mm -hmm. kind of looks ugly, the white, bluish white, and people really write the miss, miss the warm colors of incandescent light bulbs, and that is where we come in with our LED technology. We, we uh, offer yet the next generation of replacement for those light bulbs and this is light emitting diodes uh, in the colors red, green and blue combined to make a beautiful white. You can tune the color, you would get back, this is what people have been missing in the compact fluorescent tubes. They would be highly energy efficient, 150, 200 lumens per watt and they would last like kind of like forever. And so, so there's an initial higher cost, but then in, it, it pays itself over the electricity savings within a couple of years easily. And what we're doing is, and particularly in our group, is, is take the green portion of the spectrum. That's kind of a little bit less developed, and there are still the highest potential gains to be had by efficiency improvements. We use metal-organic vapor phase epitaxy grown on sapphire substrates and make epitaxial structures of LEDs. And, and the trick is really how you make that, how to make them bright, how to make them efficient and to get most of the light out. Still, they're mostly heaters, but, but we're very confident that with our approach we get them to be mostly light sources rather than heaters. And, and that is definitely the direction that Partner of Energy is supporting that. They're very excited about such progress in our group and they're funding us. And with our students, we have an excellent team to, to really just get there. And, and RPI just offers such an environment. They've dedicated for solid state lighting. That's the phrase here, solid state lighting. And, and so month by month, we're getting brighter, having new ideas of, of how to get those things in, into commercial production also.